So most of the grove is looking darn good, but we did find this tree that has a common and unfortunate problem, powdery mildew. And this particular bloom spike has a lot of powdery mildew. It's, uh, there's a lot of gray uh, on a lot of these little uh, areas, actually very few areas that don't have any gray. Now powdery mildew is something that's associated with cool, dry weather. Often when you have a lot of mango bloom and cool, dry weather, powdery mildew pops up. It's very common in Florida and in India, and I'm sure lots of other places in the world. And uh, powdery mildew seems to affect the mango bloom, the young fruit, and young leaves. Now, it has this effect here of getting these these stems become gray there's like this powdery looking stuff on a lot of the small branches and blooms and that's powdery mildew it spreads easily the one thing that has helped us recently is we had some rain and the rain will actually wash the spores off and so it helps prevent spreading one thing that we do when there's very small areas affected is we'll actually cut off the parts that have powdery mildew on them. So you don't want to spread it by waving it around in the air. Would have been nice to open that bag first, I guess. Um, so anyway, right from the tree into the bag and get it out of this area. So we have several of these panicles that are showing powdery mildew. So we will just cut them off and get them out of the way. There's some I'll have to come back with, with a ladder for. But it spreads very easily. As again, we're hoping that the rain a couple days ago washed the spores or some of the spores away. It's definitely helpful to have rain and uh, generally damp conditions because again, powdery mildew likes the cool, dry weather. So one thing that you can do, of course, is take off the, the uh, areas that are affected. Uh, another thing is if you are close to a hose, which we are not, uh, you can just spray the heck out of the area that has powdery mildew in it. I, I would recommend taking off the affected uh, panicles first and then spraying everything around it. So if you have a lot of powdery mildew over your trees, uh, the best thing to do is to spray with a fungicide like sulfur. And you don't just spray the blooms, you spray everything on the tree because the spores of powdery mildew could be hanging out somewhere else. So. Spray it down and hopefully that will just take care of the problem, but you do need to watch your trees to see if there's any new outbreaks of powdery mildew on them. So here's my little bouquet of powdery mildew. It's uh, always sad to take off little fruits, but you know, keep in mind you have hundreds if not thousands of little fruits on a tree this size. This tree isn't even that big. So take off what you can and so the, the healthy bloom stays healthy. 